Hello guys, Aiden Adventures in Airtime here. Um, as you can see, I'm at Blackpool Pleasure Beach on a cold Monday morning. It's Monday the 30th of October, and I'm here to uh, have a day at the park, but also check out the Icon construction updates. Because as you can see here, it's just on my main car park. You can see they've got a lot of supports here. That's in like, it might be hard to see on video, it's in like a a dark bluey grey kind of colour um, and then the track is in like a similar to like Nardi, uh, Audi's Nardo grey which is a car colour so that's how it looks in person to me sort of like a light grey but not too light still got a bit of darkness to it obviously you can see the end of the track that's in like a, a creamy coloured but that's just that's just what they do with the mating surfaces I think where the track slots together I think that's what they do but yeah, they've got like another delivery happening right now, which is pretty cool. Got a company called DNA Fabrications Limited, they're Steelworks. And then we've got a delivery truck over there from Belgium it looks like. Um, it's got a load of tracking, I had a look in the back earlier. When Well, when I drove into the car park I, I could see the track through the back, I didn't go and peek in it. Um, I can see it's full of track again, twisty track it looks like, so yeah. It's really exciting to see this for Blackpool. Um, I haven't been to this park since last year, so I'm going to be looking around the park to see all the other all the other stuff they've been doing. They've build, been building a station. They've been doing loads of groundwork, getting ready for this track to get put in. So yeah, it's exciting. Apparently, it's going to get built over the the closed winter season is when it's the main building stuff's going to happen, and then through next year, some point next year, it's going to open. So yeah pretty awesome you can see here this is just a bit of twisty track a little bit of straight track there there's a, a bit of the double double spine well double thickness spine over there apparently that's going to go where the big dipper where it goes sort of close to the big dipper um, and then over here we've got some launch track it looks like really straight and it's got the like the, the launch fin kind of thing that you see on them so that's awesome So yeah, I'll be uh, looking around the park at all the updates, and I'll uh, keep you updated. Never seen this before. They're actually they lift the lift the track up and then they're driving the lorry forwards. So like the track is like coming out. Didn't realise this is how they do it to be honest. Pretty cool. You can see like the track and the crane are stationary. Lorry's moving forwards. It's a bit hard to see because I'm quite far away. I didn't want to get too close and piss them off because it's annoying when you're moving big stuff like this you don't want to be distracted by people like me just like coming really close and being annoying so I was expecting the, uh, was expecting the track to go up and out but
So yeah, I've never seen this in person. I've only seen it in pictures and video before. Shout out to Pleasure Beach Experience. Um, but this is a station area. This is where the bridge used to start and go across. It's gone now. See like the platforms started to get built. I'm not sure how this is going to end up looking. It's just got like simple cladding on at the moment, but I'm hoping they're going to theme it to some kind of like Japanese pagoda or something like that. Is what I can see in my head, especially because like the it's got like the bars that go across the roof, so you can't see it when it's finished. I'm assuming you won't be able to see the actual roof like sloping down. So that kind of look, makes it sound like it will be like a, a pagoda kind of thing, but who knows? Yeah, you can see it lines up that tunnel lines up with that tunnel perfectly well so yeah cool to see it in person yeah you can see how close it comes to uh, the Big Dipper and the Pleasure Beach Express it's pretty awesome to see it like this in person and down here we turn around I guess that's the last little bit of the uh, Tom Sawyer bridge that used to be there See here where they've like uh, this is where the tunnel is where the launches go through and it'll go up and over through that gap there and uh, yeah I, I didn't know this building was here I don't know what that building is I think it's a new building I think I'm guessing is that something to do with the station or uh, not the station the shop or the exit shop or something like that I don't know you can see here where they've they've cut right up against the uh, the Eddie Stobart ride thing. Uh, you can see there's a dump truck there. So you can see the station in the background. So you can really see this ride from everywhere around the park. Marketing. Will you? See, this is the uh, where the go karts entrance used to be. You can see by the checkered flag. Now we've just got two massive support. Well, where the supports are going to go? It's actually just the concrete. It's pretty cool. Yeah, supports all around this area. See some of the supports even go in between steeplechase and the Big Dipper, like underneath there apparently. So I'm at the Burger King, uh, Burger King train station. And uh, yeah, you can see here, it's hard to see, but there's some support through here as well. This is sort of, if you look, this is next to the first drop of the big one. Well, the lift hill of the big one. Then uh, yeah, see some support, some places where supports are going to go. Didn't even know, what, I don't even know why it's going around here, to be honest, I don't know why. I didn't think there'd be supports coming this far over, but I guess they are. <laughs> I also like the uh, wooden, the wooden uh, platform to like if the if the tray if the big one valley's there, I've got like a wooden platform to to rescue you from that just goes down to the <laughs> next to the train track. Yeah, this is a view I've not seen in person for a long time, and you can see 
They've done a lot of work, a lot of supports down here. Looks like they're laying concrete across all of that bit because they've, they've recently put down the uh, waterproof membrane it looks like. So it looks like they're going to probably concrete all this, the box it all in. Brought all the supports down as well so it looks like they're going to go up soon. I don't think these supports were here in the recent updates I've seen. So it looks like they're going to get fitted soon. Probably to these maybe. A lot of short pieces, so it looks like it probably is for the, uh, the station and the launch bit maybe. A lot of cladding has gone up here. You can see the station platforms in there. So since we were here earlier, they've actually finished the, uh, well almost finished the platform. Uh, in the video earlier that was like uh, sort of half done, but you can see now it's pretty much all the structures there for the platform. I don't know if they've done anything else, they've been working uh, underneath here, there's a net here that they're putting up. There's a net there, you can see at the back. Uh, they were doing some stuff up here earlier, I don't know what it was, but... Yeah, it seems like they're working on it pretty fast. I showed you earlier, there's all the supports down there ready to uh, be put into place, it looks like, so pretty awesome. So yeah, the, that's the end of the construction update. I, uh, I'm recording this afterwards, I forgot to uh, I forgot to end the video when I was actually at the park yesterday. Had a really good time. Um, I didn't make, I didn't do a, a vlog of the day because I was just trying to enjoy it with my uh, girlfriend, so I didn't vlog the day. I did get some video of certain parts of the park, and I got the construction update. So uh, there will be a couple more videos probably coming up soon for that uh, visit. But yeah, we also me and Ewan did a thought park visit. I think last month. Um, I need to finish that video, so that'll be coming soon. Thanks for watching. Um, if you liked it, give us a like, a subscribe, and see you later. Thank you. Bye.